so. Hi. How you doing? Thank you. Clap for me, sir. That's okay. I kind of like that. Yeah, I'll run the show. You just have a seat. Uh, uh. Okay. I'm starting to get it, but I still haven't released myself what, what, to get what, everything. What do you think that is? Uh, just me. I'm the only one standing in my way right now. Mm -hmm. Believe me, before I came in here, I wanted to manipulate you. Mm -hmm. I wanted to write cue cards for you so they could hold them up here, and you right. could say, Jeff is doing fine, right. Jeff is doing better. So when you look inside, have you been able to identify the triggers for your anxiety? Yeah, yeah, I mean, I have, you know, some of the triggers are validated, but my reaction to it was wrong, and I know that my reaction was wrong, and, um, and I'm learning how to not have that reaction. But to control the anxiety, it's hard. I've had some, you know, days where I just cry all day, and I'll have days where I'll get angry and go running down the driveway. Uh, he's not gonna really expose himself too much. He's still pretty guarded. He's still trying to not really go into any uh, deep, dark secret. I've been able to manipulate your system here to do something, you know, to do things that I, I shouldn't be doing. The second, the third day here, I signed up for computer time. Why not? You're allowed to, I'm allowed to. Check her email, check my email. Check her MySpace page, check my, yeah, so, mm -hmm. you know. But then I turned myself in, and I called Jen, and I said, hey, Jen, I felt bad I did this, and she yelled at me right away. Yeah. You know, oh, you're not getting better, click. Yeah. Then I called her back, and I said, hey, no, I made a mistake. I, you know, I did, you know, I had it available to me. Right. I, you know, worked the system. He really attempted to be as real as he could possibly be without really exposing himself too much. I was okay with that. He's got lots of work to do. The scary part to me is I'm gonna be dropped right back in yeah. to you know, basically the same situation and I know it's a lot of work on both ends if it's even gonna work out. I called you, I called Dr. Phil to save my marriage but you can't save my marriage. Creative care can't save my marriage. Jennifer can't even save my marriage. Only, only I can save my marriage. If there's a marriage to save, I can save myself right now and that's kind of what I wanna do. Is your marriage dead in the water? Do you think it's headed for divorce? I wouldn't be surprised, and if that's where I put it, then that's where I put it, and I'll take responsibility for that. I can, all I could do right now is apologize to Jennifer. All the crap is already over. But are you being honest with yourself? Because yeah. you say, okay. I, I can, that's in the past when I start behaving differently, but since you've been in the program, you, you've called her until three o'clock in the morning. You've called her a liar and a cheat because of some phone message that was left. You've called her mother and said your daughter is a whore. You know what? You've, you've I, called her numerous times uh, across the way. And, and as a result, I, I'm wondering okay. if she feels like you really are trying to let go and respect her as a human being. I'm not perfect. I'm going to make mistakes. I'm not going to only make mistakes in therapy. I'm going to make mistakes out in the real world. And I would like couples counseling even so that even if we're together or if we're not, that she works on her reaction with me too so that it doesn't trigger me off into coming up excuses and then we're going in the same circle that we've been in. And I'm going to do my best not to make a mistake. But inevitably, it's going to happen. Well, I guess it was yesterday you told our producers that you thought what was going to happen is... We were going to bring you in from one side of the stage and bring her in from the other and y'all would meet in the middle and we would declare another marriage saved by Dr. Phil. No, I, I, I didn't say that. I, I, actually, I've never you said that. You told Jen sure. that and Jen told us. Uh, that. Okay, uh, and that wasn't just a couple of days ago. I said that in my, what I would love to have. That's your dream of what you would in, like in, to in see. My, obviously, I, I came and I still have the same goals as I did. I would love to stay married to Jennifer. Would love to. If it can happen, I don't know. But I would like to end the show and I told them, that I told one of the producers this weeks ago, I would love to end the show where we walk down behind you, you, know, you grab your wife's hand, I have my wife's hand, and we walk off. That would be perfect. Sweep, sweep, we're there. But honestly, I don't think it's going to happen, and that's Did okay. Did you just say sweep, sweep, yeah, and sorry. we're there? Yeah. <laughs> that may be the strangest thing I've ever heard anybody say. Well, hey, that's okay. I got 30 more days to work it out. Do you have a story or a question for me? Click the link in the description and tell me what in the world is going on.